I knew what test to order. I had to present to the attending. <laughs> Done. I'm a doctor. Your girl kind of a little bit knows what she's doing. Like Welcome back to another bloggy blog, bloggy blog, bloggy vlog. Yeah, if you're new around here, hello, my name is Tay. I am a third year medical student at UCLA. Nope, other side. Ugh. Boom. That's me. Documenting this journey to the MD, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button to stay in the loop and join our fam. I know long time no see, but I'm checking in with y'all today. Today we are doing a skills lab. I'm on my emergency medicine rotation. It's super quick, it's like a week and a half long, but we have this fun skills lab filled with intubation, learning, lumbar puncture, all these things. So I figured I'd bring you along for the ride today so you can see some of the things you might learn if you choose to go to medical school. So I'm on campus right now, Geffen Hall in the parking lot and let's head in. See you soon. All right, y'all, quick study break to tell you all about our awesome sponsor for today's video, Lull. Lull is an incredible company created to help people sleep better so they can live better and you know your girl needs sleep. The best part is they deliver right to your door and you guys know as a medical student, I barely have enough time to go grocery shopping, you know, let alone mattress shopping. But with Lull, you can order whatever size mattress and accessories you need online and it's delivered right to your door. And let me tell you, setup was a breeze. Literally took me less than 10 minutes. I mean, it doesn't get much better than this. A moment of silence for the expansion. Y'all see that? Chef's kiss. Chef's kiss. I am so glad that Lil reached out to me and they actually had really good timing because I am moving back into my parents' house for my next block of clinical rotations. And what better way to refuel my energy than to redo my childhood room with a new mattress? I mean, the Lull mattress is the perfect combo of soft and firm. It makes it the perfect spot for a long study sesh or a study break nap, if you know what I'm saying. But seriously, I could sit on this mattress all day. I could sit on this mattress all day. It doesn't even compare to my old mattress. It's in a whole different league. But seriously guys, as a personal trainer, I know how important rest is, especially for muscle recovery to make sure that you can get up and get moving again the next day. But I don't think it really hit me until starting my third year of medical school, how important getting quality sleep really is. And Lull has been a game changer for me. And if you're on the fence, Lull offers a 365 night stress-free trial free shipping, and a lifetime warranty. So there's so much flexibility to make sure that you're getting the right mattress for you, you're getting the right accessories for your sleep. So, y'all, if you're looking to upgrade your sleep, they have been so kind to provide us with a link for up to $600 off, $600 off your favorite Lull mattress. So link is in the description, and let me know if you have any questions. I hope you love it as much as I do.
got our vessel in the center of the screen. Okay. She said one centimeter. It's giving us a minute. Yeah, it's okay. giving us a minute. There's the tub. And then she moves it to the vessel. Mm -hmm. And I think it's hard to be what never done it. Move it off. Done. That's how it works. All right, good morning, y'all. So it is now Friday and you missed nothing after the skills lab yesterday. I literally came home and watched movies all day in bed because there's some free time on emergency medicine rotation because you're doing shift work. So you're only in the emergency department for eight hours a day. That said, my shift starts in about 25 minutes and uh, I need to go. I woke up like two hours ago. I did a quick workout class, um, full body, sweat, burned like 800 calories, feeling really good. So now I'm going to clean up, throw some scrubs on. My clinical site is literally like around the corner. So super quick, just gonna hop on over and hopefully we have a good shift in the emergency department today. Hopefully it's not too crazy, fingers crossed, but I will take you with me as we go through this shift. This is only my second shift of the rotation. So I just started like two days ago. I'm excited. You excited? Let's go. So I just saw my first patient and it went super well. Uh, I got to do a full history and physical on my own. I feel so much more comfortable than I did the last time I was here at the VA, uh, which was for internal medicine, my first rotation. So I knew what tests to order. I had to present to the attending and it's kind of cool knowing stuff. So now I'm gonna write his note and you know, just check in with him throughout the day. We'll see what else comes in. Let's go. Checking in, it is 5, 10 p.m. now, and we have three hours left of our shift. It's going pretty well. My patient actually from my first shift on Wednesday, he's back. Um, his lab values are a little out of whack, so it looks like we're gonna admit him just to make sure we can stabilize everything. I'm gonna write his note. I got to go see him. I really like him, he's so sweet. But yeah, hopefully chill rest of the night. I'm going to write this note and we'll see what else happens. We got dismissed early today. You know, I could totally be an emergency department doctor, okay? This shift work is nice. This shift work is nice. Um, so I'm headed home, it's 7, 10 p.m. They don't make you see a new patient in the last hour of your shift because it just makes things difficult since you can't actually like follow the patient through and through um, since someone else is gonna be coming on. So they sent me home and I am happy. But it was a really cool day today. I got to see two patients on my own, which was nice and got to present to the attending and all that stuff. It just, it's so crazy how nervous I used to be about doing those things. If you watch any of my other vlogs from internal medicine flashback, that was like six months ago and now your girl kinda a little bit knows what she's doing. Like I can come up with a differential. My first patient had um, leg weakness, bilateral leg weakness, so both sides. And I was able to kind of shuffle through the different things that it could be and talk to the attending about it and decide what tests to run and actually like understand what I'm saying. So that was pretty cool. I got to rule out a stroke, no stroke. But yeah, so now I am headed home and the rest of the day, I'm literally just gonna eat and go to sleep. We don't have a shelf exam at the end of this rotation, so it's a chill time. Um, it's a chill time. So I won't bore you with the rest of my night, but just know that there is free time in medical school. There is time for yourself to breathe. I was able to exercise today. I'm out before the sun goes down. Um, I came in at noon and 
it's been a really good day. So I will sign off here and I will see you in the next video. This is kind of a flash forward vlog because I have vlogs from that are actually in chronological order. Um, so right now you're seeing me in present tense. This vlog will be updated one day after what I'm doing right now. So this is my present me, but don't worry, I will have the vlogs up for the rest of my internal medicine rotation, my pediatrics rotation, my OB-GYN rotation, surgery, those will all be up. So yeah, but just know your girl is doing well. It's just been, it's been a year. But I will see you guys in the next video. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you next time. Okay, bye!